Tim, nice to meet you. Uh, I need a, um, a balloon, okay. a special balloon, a bulletproof balloon. Bulletproof balloon. Bulletproof balloons. Bulletproof balloons? Bulletproof balloons. We just had a look here, but I don't know where they are. Well, now we're talking, that's life? now we're talking. That's good. Maybe ordinary party balloons will do the trick. Now I just need some people to help me with my experiment. Come with me, come here, right? I want to borrow you guys for an hour, if that's all right. Excuse me, guys. I know what this is. Ten balloons full of water. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to shoot them. Shoot them with what? Gonna shoot from one end with a big gun. What I want to know is how many balloons do you think will it take to stop the bullet? Stopping a bullet? No. No, listen. Ain't happening. I mean, what kind of gun are you going to shoot? That's a Magnum. 44. Oh, no. Oh, no. yeah. Dirty Absolutely Harry. Not. Nope. OK, well, hang on. Here's my question, guys. I want to know how many of these balloons it will take to stop a bullet from a 44 Magnum. It's not like it's military tactical vest or it's a shield. I mean, it's a balloon with water. It ain't going to work. It ain't going to happen. OK, so none of them will stop it. OK, how many are you saying? Seven. Seven of the 10. All right, then, how many do you reckon? I would probably say four. I mean, look at the, look at, they've got four, some weight. There's, honestly? Yes, four. four. I'm going with four. Or will it be none of the above? Do you want to meet Chuck, one of the greatest firearm specialists of all time? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I what appreciate that. Oh. <laughs> this is a Smith & Wesson 44 Magnum. It's one of the most powerful handguns on the planet. And it shoots a 250 grain bullet at 1,500 to 1,800 feet per second. So it's about 1,000 miles per hour. It's quick. OK, let's get behind the blast shield, guys, all right? Come let's on. Go. Right, you guys ready to do this? Oh, yeah. That's Everyone awesome. ready? Awesome. Chuck, are you ready? Yes. OK. Make fingers, me proud, Chuck. Fingers in the ears. Let's get it. All right, in your own time. Come here, come here, come on. Oh, All of them, I don't think so. I One, two, three, four. I'll tell you what, let's see if it's in there. Whoa. One, two, three, four balloons to stop a slug of a 44 Magnum. Let's have a look at that again in slow mo. The bullet enters the fourth balloon, but it loses so much velocity that it just can't get through the far side and bounces back inside the balloon. Right, so why? How come? All right, it's all to do with density, OK? As soon as the bullet leaves the gun, it starts slowing down, because it's got to cut through the air. And then all of a sudden, this bullet, which is prepared to go for miles and miles and miles, bumps into balloon number one, which is full of water. Now, the thing about water is water is super dense. It right. takes out so much energy from that bullet, it slows it down. It's like trying to run through a swimming pool. It's so hard. Yep. Whereas you can just run through air, no worries, right? Right. And we have a winner in the house. <laughs> Thanks, Chuck. You Devastated. Let me down,